So we're living in a day and age where most of us are using ChatGPT every single day for one reason or another. You know, we're maybe using it for basic research, maybe even to come up with some sort of recipe. And we're probably using it as a friend or therapist, but a lot of us are not using it when it comes to starting a side hustle. So I thought, you know what, in today's video, I'm gonna show you what I personally do when it comes to using ChatGPT to help me set up a side hustle in four simplistic steps. But I do need to say before I get into this video that it shouldn't be taken as financial advice. All I'm simply going to be doing is giving you guys my own experience, you know, what I've been able to do when it comes to using ChatGPT. So just treat this video as a form of entertainment or even education. But I'm sure by the end of it, you're going to have a full understanding as to how all of this stuff works. So these are the four different steps right here. And essentially, this side hustle consists of building some sort of a website, a website that could be monetized in a number of different ways. You don't need to sell any type of product on it. It's going to be a website where you're going to be publishing articles that, fingers crossed, are going to get ranked in the Google search results. Most people don't even realize that this side hustle exists, but there's so many people out there doing it right now and they're able to capitalize from it. So one of the first steps that you're going to take when it comes to using ChatGPT to do this, or the first step that I take, is to use it when it comes to creating a personalized step-by-step -step side hustle plan. One thing that tends to hold back so many beginners, including myself when I first got started with all of these different internet businesses, is that you're not really sure of exactly what you're doing, you know, what it's going to be centered around, and there's just so much confusion. But with the power of a tool like ChatGPT, you're going to be able to instantly figure out, you know, exactly what's going to work well for you in your own personal situation based on your personality, your skill set, so on and so forth. So the way that you can do this is to get a personalized prompt. So first things first, what you're going to do is just go over to this blog business plan builder. It's going to take you through a series of different questions. If you've been watching my channel recently, you would have seen it. You know, there's around five, six different questions. And by the end of it, you're going to get a prompt that you can now paste into ChatGPT. So let me just quickly walk you through it just so that you get an idea of exactly how it works. So question one is what type of topics do you enjoy writing or talking about? I found from my own experience that if you're able to pick a niche that centers around your own interest, it's going to make things a lot more easier because there's going to be various different difficulties and issues that you're going to face. But if you're building a website that is centered around something you're passionate about, you're going to be able to push past all of those issues. So in today's example, what I'm going to be doing is selecting this one over here, travel and lifestyle. You know, I've traveled to over 20, 30 different cities. So I believe that I'm going to be able to do this well. Question two is what type of website do you want to build? So you've got the option of a personal blog, you know, e.g. using your name, your face, your identity, or what you can do is build a branded website with a unique brand name. So a personal blog, of course, is going to have www. followed by your first name, your last name, you know, however you want to do it, .com. However, the branded option is going to be somewhat faceless. It's not going to have a actual identity, but it's going to have the identity of the brand that you're building. Let me give you an example of what I'm talking about. So if you just head over to www.successwithbusiness.com, this is one of three different blog websites that I'm putting a lot of energy into right now. Just taking a look at it, you can see that it's not really centered around myself. Yes, there might be a page that has my face and a story of how I started this website. But generally speaking, it's not really about me, but it's more about the information that I'm providing to my readers. So this is the way that I would go. Of course, it's completely up to you. But in today's video, I'm just going to select this one. Question three is, do you want AI to write your blog articles for you? So, of course, the way that you're going to run this side hustle is going to come in the form of you publishing blog articles as often as possible. And writing the articles yourself isn't bad whatsoever, but if you're able to get AI to write the articles, e.g. ChatGPT or some other AI tool, this is going to be much easier because you're going to be able to be a lot more consistent. And right now, most of you are probably thinking about Sam, is AI content even allowed when it comes to publishing it on blog websites and giving your website the chance of being ranked on Google in the first place? Well, the answer to that is yes, but let's find out together. So if I just jump onto Google, I'm just going to type in this search term that says, does Google dislike AI content? I'm just going to type it in like that and then click on search. And if I just scroll down slightly, there is this site over here that's called Google Search 
guidance about AI generated content. So I'm just going to click into this link. And right here on Google Search Central, we can see this question that says, is AI content against Google search guidelines? And the answer to this is appropriate use of AI or automation is not against our guidelines. This means that it's not used to generate content primarily to manipulate search rankings, which is against our spam policies. So in short, they're saying that as long as you're using AI to produce high quality content, you know, they're not going to ban you. They're not going to derank you or anything like that. They just want to make sure that when someone lands on your website, they're going to receive all the information they need. So now that we've got this answer, let's go back over to the blog website, Business Plan Builder. So I'm going to select, yes, fully AI written articles and then click on next. Question four is, do you want an AI blog website or WordPress website? Of course, we want to use AI. So I'm going to click on this one. And finally, how do you plan to monetize your blog? So you've got the option of either affiliate marketing, selling digital products, you know, eBooks, guides, things like that ad revenue, Google AdSense, sponsored posts, or even brand deals. Ideally, what you want to do is try and monetize from all of them. So you can click on this, but if you want to focus on just one initially, you can just select it. In this case, I'm going to say that I want to focus on selling digital products for the sake of this video, and then I'm going to click on next. Okay, perfect. So it's now come back with this prompt that you need to paste into ChatGPT. And from there, it's gonna give you all of the information you need when it comes to being able to set this up. So if I just go over to ChatGPT right now, you can use a completely free account. You don't even need to sign in. So I'm just gonna say, stay logged out. I'm gonna paste it in there just like this and then click on enter. And just like that, as you can see, it's already gone straight to work to give me all of the information I need in a step-by-step -step format. You know, everything I need when it comes to getting this side hustle off the ground. Because I've made sure to select specific answers to the questions that it asked me, it now knows exactly what type of blog website I'm interested in building. So that's basically it for this first initial step right here. But let's swiftly move on to the second step, which is that you can use ChatGPT now to help you when it comes to providing a list of successful blog websites within your niche that you can spy on so that you can also get estimated revenues. So by no means am I saying just because you can see how much money a website is making, you're going to be able to do the exact same thing, but you could just use it as a proof of concept, you know, as a guide, just to kind of give you, you know, something to look forward to if you're able to put the work in. But let me show you exactly what I mean. So if I just go back over to the custom business plan, Within it, there's going to be this section that says competitor analysis. And this is a very crucial step that you guys need to be aware of, because as you can see, it's giving me a list of all of these different competitors, the estimated monthly traffic based on that traffic, you know, the monthly earnings as well as the direct URL. So I'm now going to be able to click into any one of these and don't forget the website niche that I'm going to be focusing on in this video is going to be centered around travel. So if I just click into this person's site. Okay. So this is an example of a successful blog website that's operating right now. And ChatGPT is saying that it's bringing in a decent amount of income. So let's double check the traffic just to make sure that they're actually getting people onto the site. The way that I'm going to do that is by using this tool over here called similar web. I'm using the Google Chrome extension tool and we can see that the monthly visits is around half a million people. So that's really impressive for a simple blog website where all they're doing is posting these different articles because they've made sure to center their site around a specific niche. And they've also made sure to be consistent when it comes to posting all of these different blog articles. They're getting half a million people onto their website, which is now going to put them in a powerful position when it comes to monetizing in so many different ways. So what I personally do during this stage is to go through as many different competitors as possible, see exactly how much traffic they're bringing in on a monthly basis, and also see how they've been able to structure their website. Because if they're successful when it comes to getting a lot of people onto their site, I'm now going to be able to replicate what they've been able to do so that I can see a similar success. And of course, this process is so much easier with the help of ChatGPT. But let's move on to something a little bit more practical now, which is the third step, which is to use ChatGPT when it comes to assisting us with building out our blog website. So the platform that you're going to use when it comes to building a website is going to be Hostinger. 
Now, I've personally been using Holstinger for many, many years. You know, it's really easy to use, straight to the point, super quick, really efficient. And they also have a AI website builder that can get a site built within a matter of seconds. And even though, yes, I've shown you guys Holstinger on this channel many, many times, but they've made some adjustments when it comes to the quality of the website that it's able to build. So what I do once I get to this point is just click on claim deal. Then what I do is come over here to the business website builder. So I can see at the moment, I'm gonna be able to get three months for completely free. And I'm also gonna be able to get all of these amazing benefits. For example, all of these different AI tools, you know, AI blog writer, which is going to be helpful. In a moment, I'm gonna show you that. Of course, the AI website builder. And I'm also gonna be able to get a completely free domain as well. That's valued at around $9.99. So you're gonna take a look at all of these different features if you want, but I'm just gonna click on choose plan. Then what I'm gonna do from here is select the duration for how long I want the website for. And it is important to know, and this is something that I realized when I was setting things up, is that if I want to benefit from the three months for completely free, it's going to come with the 48 month plan. So I've just found with the longest period, it's where you're gonna be able to get the biggest discounts and all of the different benefits. But of course, it's completely up to you for however long you want the website for. Even if you select one month, you can always extend it, but you're just not gonna be able to get the benefits up front. But for now, I'm just gonna click on 48 months. I'm gonna come over here to coupon code, and this is the code that I type in. I just type this in just so that I can save a little bit when it comes to the total amount. So I'm just gonna leave it like this and then click on continue. From there, what it's going to do is take me over to this page where I'm gonna be able to claim my free domain. So to get this, what you're going to do is just go back over to the business plan that ChatGPT initially gave you. And there should be a section here that's going to have, you know, all of these different brand names that you can choose from that are most likely available right now. And I do need to say that, of course, if you have your own name, you can pick it. You know, if there's something that is sentimental to you when it comes to the brand that you're building, that's gonna be the best way to do it. But this is just for people that are completely confused on what to call their website. So you can just scroll through this list and see all of the available options. I'm just gonna pick a random one for today's video, which is going to be the last one in the list. I'm just gonna copy it just like this and go back over to Hostinger. I'm gonna paste it in here and see if it's available by clicking on check availability. And yeah, perfect, right there, as we can see, it is available. It's completely free and I'm gonna be able to get it right now. But once that's been done, the next stage is to actually start the process of building and designing the site. So as you guys already know, Hostinger is gonna be able to design a blog website super, super quick. And the way that ChatGPT can help with this part of the process is when it comes to giving you the description to copy and paste into this box so that Hostinger knows exactly what type of website you're looking to build. So because I already know what the brand name is, I'm just gonna put it in here just like this. Then what I'm gonna do is go back over to the business plan. And it's gonna be within the plan that you're going to see something along the lines of get started with Hostinger's AI website builder. And it's also going to give you a 700 character prompt. So you can read through it, make sure that you're happy with it, make sure that it aligns with the blog that you're looking to build. In this case, I can see that it does. So I'm just going to copy it just like this. I'm gonna come back over to Hostinger and I'm gonna paste it in here just like that. And what I'm gonna do from there is just click on create a website. As you can see, it's already gone to work to start building out the website. You know, it's probably gonna take two seconds or so. I can see that it's already done. Yep, so the site has now been built. This is a preview of what it looks like. If I wanna change the color scheme of the site, you know, Hostinger is gonna give me that flexibility to do so. But for now, what I'm gonna do is click on continue. And it's gonna be over here that I'm gonna be able to get a clearer look of exactly what the website is going to look like once people start going on it. So I'm sure that you guys are probably amazed at how you know professional this looks, how unique it looks. There's no website on the planet that is exactly like this and it was able to do it in less than 10 seconds. It goes without saying that once you get your website built, if you're thinking about doing this, you're gonna have to go through it, you know, make any adjustments to it, but you know, Hosting has done an amazing job of being able to get a blog website built super, super quick. But 
This now brings me on to one of the final things or final ways that you can use ChatGPT when it comes to this particular side hustle, which is going to be producing the blog article ideas. Now, the good thing about Hostinger is that they've got an inbuilt blog writing tool that's going to produce a fully written article really quick with a few clicks of a button. So let me quickly show you what I'm talking about. So if I just go over to the blog tab, what I'm gonna do is come over here to the left-hand side you should see something like AI tools and there's gonna be this one that says AI blog generator. So if I just click into it, Hosting is gonna give me the option of producing an article between 300 to 500, 800 to 1000 or 1500 to 2000 words. Ideally, you wanna make the articles pretty long, you know, maybe this option, but for the sake of this video, I'm just gonna select 800 to 1000 words, even though this one isn't going to take too much time. You've also got the option of changing the tone of voice as well. If you want it to be casual, neutral or formal, it's completely up to you. I'm gonna leave it as neutral for now. And then all you gotta do from here is just enter a blog title for the article that you want to publish. So the way that you can do this again is to come up with it yourself. Or what you can do is just go back over to the side hustle plan because it's going to be within this plan where it's going to give you all of these different blog title ideas that you can just publish once a day so i'm just going to pick one of these at random just to kind of give you an insight into how this works so let's go with this one right here how to work remotely and travel the world you know this is something that i do so it's something that stood out to me so i'm just going to copy it like this go back over to hostinger and then what I'm gonna do is just paste it in here just like this. You could just put the title of the article. You don't need to put too much information. Of course, if you want to, you can because you can add up to 700 characters, but this should be enough for Hostinger to produce a fully written article. So I'm just gonna leave it like this and then click on create content. And just like that, as you guys can see, the article has now been completed, you know, with the headings, with the image, all of the text, all of the information. If I just click into preview, this is exactly what the blog article is going to look like once someone visits the website. This is super powerful because of course, if I wanted to write an article like this, I would have been sitting here maybe for a whole day, maybe even longer than that. But with the help of ChatGPT in combination with Hostinger, I've been able to do it super quick. And I do need to say that you're of course going to need to go through it, read through it, make sure that you're happy with it. If you're thinking about doing this, you don't want to just rely solely on AI. You want to be able to use it as a tool. But the overall point of this video is just to show you how ChatGPT can help anyone out there when it comes to being productive and starting a side hustle. And I'm sure right now, most of you are probably thinking about Sam, how exactly is one going to monetize a website like this? You know, what's the point of doing it? I'm not really thinking about starting a hobby right now. So, you know, what's the point of it? Well, there's so many different ways that you can monetize from it. As I've already said, within the business plan, there's going to be certain strategies that you can use. But if you wanted to watch a recent YouTube video that I made where I explain things in a lot more detail, give you some more tips and tricks when it comes to being able to do this effectively, I'm gonna leave that video right there. Be sure to watch that straight after this because that video has helped out so many people and I'm sure if you're able to watch it from start to finish, it can also help you out as well. But other than that, guys, I'll catch you on the next video. Make sure you stay safe out there. Peace.